Stormy Cloud 21. Here is one of the more popular items that I'm going to review today. This is the Jurassic World Dominion Atrociraptor Extreme Damage. Right there is that UPC. And look at this beautiful figure. And it has a lot of texture of those scales all over this dinosaur. And then look at the battle damage right there. Getting a look at the face of this dinosaur. This is very, very cool indeed. It just looks very ferocious. Mine has a little bit of a loose jaw, but I don't mind so much. Easy to open and close, it stays closed. Right here is where you can pull open the Jurassic World Vax app. And then right here is where you control the battle damage on this dinosaur. We'll take it out of the packaging soon and look at that more up close. So now I'm zooming out again. Let's turn on the back of the packaging and see the DNA scan code to unlock, to add it to the app. Here are some others in the collection. This one I have reviewed. This one I will review in the future. It's been a little harder to obtain this one. And then right here is the double-sided damage for this figure as well, extreme damage, Triceraptor. So let's open up this figure and take a closer look. All right, so let's take this figure out of the packaging and you're gonna cut those straps, straps gently, release this figure from the packaging. Here is that beautiful Atrociraptor. Thing that stands out is this white paint down here on the feet and this claws. And then it blends into this sort of reddish brown color. And then right up here to the head, you've got those nice yellow eyes with the cat slit. I like that a lot. See, it is a little bit of a loose jaw but it's okay. The neck rotates, you can go forward articulation back like that. You can go all the way around if you wanted. Let's look inside, let's look inside that mouth, look inside there, there's the tongue and all those teeth and the inside of the mouth back in there. The striping pattern, look at the texture on the top of that head and then look at all those stripes. They did a really excellent job on this figure. Uh, look at the white on the lower part of the jaw and then of course this reddish brown up here. Um, the arms, you can rotate that, articulate. You can move the arms backward, forward, all the way around. This button right here, this button controls your battle damage. There it is, battle damage red. There it is without, you can barely see it. Even with this good lighting, it doesn't show up very good, probably either on camera. The, the legs do articulate. They are pretty stiff, but you can get them back. All the way back to there, all the way forward to there. And then this leg, you can articulate as well. There is no in and out with the articulation. The tail can go all the way around, but to fit it to match the stripes, you wanna do it like that. Here's your Jurassic World back app again. And then there is that logo on the back. Looking underneath the figure, there's the logo. And then moving this foot forward, you can see the texture underneath the hands. You can see the claws are unpainted, unless you count the original color, the base color that they used on this figure. Very nice, well-made figure from this line. I do like it. And it's a new favorite indeed. The texture, the coloration, everything on this figure is perfect. But if there's one thing I'm going to have to pick on is its ability to stand. But other than that, 
So this is just a quick little video review. This is Stormy Cloud 21. I want to thank you for watching this video. Please remember, hit the like and subscribe button. See more cool stuff coming up soon. Thanks for watching and talk soon.